Today we're making pancakes, keto friendly pancakes. They're super easy to make, they're quick, and they taste just as good as the regular flour ones. We're gonna use coconut flour, almond flour, chickpea flour. We're gonna have two room temperature eggs, softened butter, vanilla extract, salt, sugar substitute, heavy cream, and baking powder. Let's get started. First of all, we're gonna add all our ingredients into the blender, but we're not gonna put the baking powder yet. I'm putting my eggs, all my flours, I'm gonna have the specific measurements in the description box below. I'm adding the heavy cream, I'm adding softened butter. It's not super cold, it's pretty softened. And I'm adding my vanilla extract. And now I'm gonna give them all a quick blend. Now, after giving them a blend, I'm adding the baking powder. The baking powder makes a really good difference in the pancakes, so don't forget that. Now, I'm getting my saucepan and I'm putting butter in it on medium heat but not a lot of butter and now I'm adding my batter and before the pancake starts cooking I'm making sure to put them into the shape that I want them to I put them into a little circle shape so it cooks into that shape and when I start seeing that the bottom color starts browning I am lowering the heat and then I'm going to flip it. And then I'm going to leave it for another minute to continue cooking evenly. And then I'm just going to repeat the same process as I go. Um, the pancake takes around three to four minutes all on both sides to evenly cook. Make sure to, once you start seeing the browning color at the bottom, you flip the pancakes and repeat. So take your time, give the pancakes their time to cook so they don't get burnt and to cook evenly. Now as they're super hot and warm, put your piece of butter and put your maple syrup. I'm using um, unsweetened maple syrup. And if you want to keep your pancakes and store them for another day, just keep them in the fridge um, very well covered on top with a tight saran wrap on top without any toppings. And then the next day when you want to use them, just microwave them for just a few seconds, 30 to 40 seconds, and they're going to be ready to go just as good as the regular pancakes. Enjoy! Enjoy!